My name is Jack Cable. I'm 17 years old and I'm from Chicago. So I've been doing bug bounties for about two years now. And yeah, I really like the challenge and excitement that goes along with it. It's a hobby right now. I mainly focus on school. A lot of people don't know about it. So <laughs> the ones who do think that it's like really interesting. Yeah, so I'm in high school right now. So I'll have to make up work from all of my classes for being in Ukraine. <laughs> yeah, so I'll be entering university next year. And I plan to like study either math or computer science. So I don't really know what I want to do beyond that, but just like sort of exploring now and I'll see where I wind up. Yeah, I got into hacking about two years ago. I accidentally found a vulnerability in a financial site that would let me send a negative amount of money to other users and that would steal money from their accounts then. So that company ran a bug bounty program, so I reported to them and then I gradually found like other bug bounty platforms like HackerOne and I started like learning more about cybersecurity and hacking and trying to just help companies improve their security. So I think a big part of um, being a bug bounty hunter is to continuously learn new uh, things that you can apply to find vulnerabilities, so whether it's different vulnerability types or different techniques that might help you discover more like surface of a company. It's really a, a lot of it is about learning and you can like learn from other hackers and try to just like really keep learning, see what you can do, what you can find and how you can improve. There's a lot of times where you might have like problems finding vulnerabilities or there might be something that you're working on for a while. So I think like when you have something that's difficult and you need to work on it for a while, it really is rewarding like once you figure it out and sometimes you also don't figure it out and then you just have to move on and like find the next vulnerability. Yeah, so I found Ukraine to be very interesting. Um, it really is has been a great experience from like the hacking to exploring the cities, both Kiev and Kharkiv, and just really to like get to experience another culture. Kiev especially is a really great city. There's a lot of cool architecture, the history about it's like thousands of years old. So like compared to America, <laughs> it's so much older and the buildings just really like reflect the history of the city. Yeah, I think that Hacken is an interesting um, project because like, it might allow companies to better find like, white hat hackers to help improve their securities. Ukraine is an interesting situation because it's starting to develop its like, technology scene more. So I think that like, certain projects related to technology related to security would certainly be like, a big benefit to the country.